my friend Jean Serge Gagnon today we're going to talk about no bull no BS marketing to the affluent now the reason I want to talk about this marketing to the affluent because you know that's something I want to do so marketing to the ultra rich the people who actually have money are the people that are you know most not I wouldn't say most likely but at least they have the money though so their ex, their excuses won't be because they don't have any money right if you're trying to sell something <coughs> why not go after the people that have money that that don't have that as an uh, an objection right so we're going to talk about how you market to somebody who has the money what is it that motivates them to invest to spend to buy whatever it is you have to sell and how do you position your marketing around that and we're going to get into that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so what do I mean by ultra affluent or you know affluent or ultra rich it's pretty obvious right it's people that are have the means of spending right so their their income and their spending is not typical you know most most people have just about enough money to pay their bills for the month right so every single month they're they're struggling and they're they don't they don't have that much disposable income now everybody does have some but the percentage of how much the affluent and the ultra rich have is like ridiculously different like for example regular people they might have five to ten percent disposable income every month that they easily spend on all kinds of things that they don't really really need or don't bring them any you know long-term value like they'll spend on going out I mean I'm, I'm no different go out to the restaurant go out to the movies buy some extra little toys you know th there's always uh, buy gifts for people whatever all those things are all you know we find things to do with our money right if you talk about the um affluent so affluent and I'm not you know I'm, this is not my definition affluence is is from the a, a book I'm actually listening to here let me show you right now I'm actually listening to this book by Dan Kennedy which is called no bs marketing to the affluent no holds barred take no prisoners guide to getting a really rich right so that's kind of funny that he talks about getting rich when he talks about marketing to the affluent so I from that I'm learning right now lots of cool things that I'm actually Im implementing right now in my marketing and uh that's what I want to talk about so affluent is somebody who's got maybe 20 percent 25 percent of their income as disposable income usually what they what the affluent do with that money is they invest it in things and they s put it in savings or you know they they don't splurge on things they usually always have 25 percent of their income and then of course the ultra rich are people who have more than 50 60 percent of their income that's disposable in other words you know in a month they might make you know 40,000 but they only have like 10,000 in spending right so like like regular people they have five to ten thousand in spending and some of them might have more in spending and more income but the percentage is really high right so they they have money so how do you market to, you know first let's just kind of admit wouldn't it be a much cooler to to market to those people to get them to buy your stuff to get them to be in your circle to get them to get your service whatever it is you're doing wouldn't it be amazing right that would be one of the coolest things is to be part of the people that sell to those people right because those people you know they they have the money right it certainly feels like oh my god that's amazing I should do that right and then when you think about it it's like those people are the ones that are the hardest to well <laughs> maybe I guess I could say that's kind of a um what's it, a false a false um uh, what's the word uh <laughs> a myth it's an urban myth that they're the hardest to sell to and that's because most people try to sell to them using traditional marketing 
if you use traditional marketing those people they're not going to buy because traditional marketing is not meant for them it's meant for the masses it's meant for the people that aren't affluent that aren't ultra rich it's meant for the regular joe that's just trying to be like the joneses right so that kind of marketing and I I I wish I could get into ex specific details because uh because I'm going kind of by memory I've been, I've been listening to this audio for for a while now and and it's just I'm just like starting to um internalize some of the things but a few of the things that I remember that I can that I'm going to be using that I can tell you about is let's do this let's do this let's go into my little uh, notepad here marketing marketing mar mar cutting to the affluent right so how do you market to the affluent right how to market to the affluent right how to market to the affluent so that's basically you know how do you do it what is it what is the difference so uh Dan Kennedy goes into you know what's the difference between uh the affluent or the ultra rich and the regular people what are the things that drive them and one of the things he talks about so what drives them whoops right what drives them is um they want they want they want exclusivity exclusivity they um they want to gain status now that's something that Mar uh Russell Brunson talks about a lot in his marketing as well he talks about status getting status but it's super more critical for the rich and the ultra affluent because they have a status of being in this club of you know being being rich I guess right being in these um kind of circles and they want to stay in those circles and you know the thing is that what scares them right what scares them and this is this is in, when you're doing marketing right you always have to think about what is it that the target market or the avatar you're marketing to wants and what do they not want or what do they want less of or what do they want to avoid right so that's why I'm saying what drives them what scares them so what scares them is losing their status right that's one thing that's really important to them and I'm trying to think right now some of the other stuff that I heard um because I'm thinking like for example if I want to market a pool like right now I'm marketing active uh, group users uh, chrome extension I'm, a, I'm marketing click ecourse website platform and those kinds of things so how do I market those to the affluent over regular people right and that's I'm not saying that though so first you want to make it an exclusive thing so you want to make it this is something that you can get into but nobody else can because there's there's a there's a there's an invite you need to get an invite so you know how to uh, create marketing for them so how do you do that so number one you can do a exclusive exclusive member membership uh, option we're using invites right so using whoops using invites right so you can do that by by creating a, an invite only platform and that kind of thing was kind of what I did with Click eCourse when you go to Click eCourse now if I open up a uh, Click eCourse let's just go to uh let's open up a new uh, tab so I'm going to go to Click eCourse right now which is my platform right so when I go to Click eCourse now and I try to register if I click on the register here it'll tell me sorry registration only opened by invite now so that that's that's the view from outside right if somebody tries to go to there without without being invited they're going to see this and then you can go to the profiles page to go see you know who is actually on the platform that maybe you know the one of these people right maybe you know one of these people and you can actually reach out to them and you can have a conversation with them say hey can I get an invite right like Philippe and Bricks and well me and then Nishal and Olga and Kim and Marnie right all these people they're of they have invites they can give right so if I know them I can maybe reach out to them if I know how to reach out and some of them have put their you know their links right like over here Sahil he's got his Twitter his LinkedIn link uh, others don't they should probably put that in because right now 
there's no way to talk to these people unless you know already how to connect with them if I don't maybe I'll connect with Sahil I'll say hey Sahil I I saw that you're on click ecourse platform I was just wondering if I could get in because this is looks like a really cool platform so now obviously you have to have something that that's attractive uh, to whoever you're trying to attract and in the case of uh ultra affluent they expect they expect you know quality right so let's just say they expect quality and they also they want to be served <laughs> um served um what's the word not unique uh like a one-on-one -on -one or what do you call it they want to be served on their terms maybe on their terms what might be a good way to do it they don't want to lose their status they don't want to wait for support right um what else they well losing their, they're, they're scared of losing their status so that means that if you're marketing to them you got to be talking about this is something that you will really absolutely love you're going to be in this unique club this is only for super um super smart or super super in uh, you know so you talk about how this is for the people that know what they're doing right this is only for elite few right so it's only for elite flu uh, let's just do that so this is only for the elite view uh if you uh, so what else can I do uh I can also <coughs> talk about uh how how you'll be able to invite your friends that you want okay the friends that you want right so that's another thing right how do you do it so if you if you create this marketing you want to make sure that they know that it's something that they'll be able to choose who joins them they don't it's not just anybody that's going to be able to get in there it's going to be just those that they choose right so that's another way of of uh, uh marketing to the affluent so they want to be unique right they want to be unique okay so yeah they want to be unique right they, they want to be unique you're serving them especially them and and you got to have a marketing that's kind of makes them feel that way right so that's one of the reasons why it's important on social media <laughs> to be saying things like you know hey how's it going what's what's your day like <coughs> I'm not talking about you know how everybody is doing and talking to to a group of people you don't want to be talking to a group of people hey how are how are my friends doing how is it going my friends right you don't want to do that you don't want to be s sub plural conversations you don't want to be unique to one person so uh what else what else can I be uh, expect quality you want to be served on their terms um and I definitely have to listen to more of this Dan Kinnead I will I am I'm like just halfway through the book right so I will be learning more but here's a few things that I've done to change what I'm doing like I said there's the whole idea of my where is it right here is that I have a Click eCourse now on an invite only so that means if you want a an account on Click eCourse you won't be able to just create an account you'll have to reach out and maybe I'll improve that somehow but the thing is that to get an, an account on Click eCourse right now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to the Click e hour so click ehour.com that'll take you to a webinar that I'm having every week so you're going to be able to join in and listen in and learn about what this platform does the kinds of benefits that it would be for you to 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 use it compared to any other platform right I've done I've done lots of blog posts on my on my blog site about um the differences so if I go for example to my to my blog site and now I'm going to have to you know market that more but if I look through here and I go to for example in the categories <coughs> uh, let's see what's going on it's it looks like it's hung oh I guess he's loading that up uh what's going on here this is 
this is weird it's like not scrolling anymore okay let me close this and reload it again don't know what's going on maybe my computer oh that's why this thing was supposed to load up okay um if I go down here and I look through the um click eCourse site right if I just click on that category it gives me the posts I did a lot about click eCourse the link tree the drip courses difference between click eCourse and what is it click four course and this is Kajabi comparison between click eCourse and uh which one is this uh business center from LSB this is difference between Skillshare Udemy teachable and then uh the virtual summit and so a whole bunch of different things you can do with the click eCourse platform I have that a lot of this on my blog as well right so you can go find that stuff on my blog and uh, there's more if I go to the next page right I mean I've been I've been promoting this site for quite a while right so I mean it's um it's a platform that lets you do all these different things set up it talks about setting up a free account now but that's not available anymore you've got to be invited right you got to get an invite and you can always get an invite from me there's uh, some uh, process you can always reach out to me and say that you'd like an account I can probably I can definitely set that up for you but it's going to be the marketing that I'm going to be doing is going to be based on that so you got to get an, an invite right and that's kind of how platforms like Google or other platforms like that got really popular by doing this kind of marketing right and okay so what else what else do these people want right so what scares them they don't want to lose their status so if you start using my tool or you start going to uh you know setting up using my platform you're going to you know really get the data the results that you need I'm actually not very good at figuring this out but whenever I think about it whenever I think about my marketing this stuff you think about it it helps to focus on what you're doing right so let's say I go to my let's me go back to uh where is it oh that's not it I want to go back to the um <clears throat> no not this one that's my email this one here okay so this is uh the cover that I just did for the click e hour which I'm going to be starting every week now on Tuesdays uh I probably should have put every Tuesday at whatever right maybe I should do that let's do that let's add some text here and let's add something that's <clears throat> how about this no which one would I should I use something that's uh something that's not too hard to read right this one maybe yeah okay so this is going to be let's uh minim let's make it smaller first right so music and let's make it instead of blue let's make it red no how about black okay I'm gonna make it every Tuesday at 9 at 8 p.m eastern okay how's that let's make that a little bit smaller and I'm gonna make it like this oops and move that over here how's that let's move that a little bit maybe I want to put an S there Tuesday at 8 p.m eastern let's just say EST EST people know what that is right let's do that there we go so that's that's using Canva to create something uh this has nothing to do with the marketing I guess let me just uh join the exclusive club maybe I should say join the exclusive club okay, let's go to the top here and just say join join the exclusive club okay so I'll just do this like this 
Make this a little bit smaller. And make this red. Let's make it red. Now, this is one way to make it this is one way to make it like you know this is exclusive join the exclusive club right so that is some wording that you use to attract the the um the affluent and ultra rich this is exclusive so it's not everybody that's going to be allowed to come here right so let's just I don't want this color this is not right I want this to be red as well and let's make it a little bit more how's that okay so that's going to be okay so I'm just going to do this I'm going to save this now like this and I'm going to save it over I have I have a copy already so I'm going to overwrite it <clears throat> go over into here it's under click e hour and let's just say this is so with time so there so now I can go to my where did I do that oh so it's under under here if I go and I edit this is my um weekly webinar schedule that I got set up here and so if you go to clickehour.com that's what you're going to get so if I edit this I'm going to change this to this one <laughs> <laughs> and then I just go finish because I just did that now if I go back to my do I have it here I do right here if I go back to the clicky hour right here if I reload this page now this image is going to be updated oh no it's not oh right this is uh I have it in the that's the hold on let's go back here so I still have to go back here edit this next next and then there's the webinar it's under registration registration page design and I got to go down here and uh, customize so gosh I just got to go change the image there too because I put the image in the in this page right so edit this and it's going to be with time there we go save and exit okay so now it's saved uh, continue finish and if I go back here now and I reload it now it's going to be the new image right so there you go right and the and the wording here every week I'm going to change this but I have to I probably have to work a little bit more on the actual you know uh, content here but um but yeah that's kind of what I'm doing right now is is migrating to use affluent marketing which I never and you know like I said I have to listen to this a couple of times probably before I really get into understanding how all that works and getting some good ideas and everything else but um but yeah so that's one of the things so what else what else can I talk about so what is it how did people become affluent most of them actually you know what is it it's positive thinking positive thinking right what scares them is negativity or people people who are pessimist right so they don't want they don't want to be part of a pessimistic group they want to be in a positive thinking you know group an optimistic positive thinking optimistic um so the other thing is uh what is it that he said I I just remember this just from <laughs> sorry about that um I also remember him talking about this just this morning he was talking about the the power of this 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 positive like all the affluent at least most of the affluent and the ultra rich are so that anyways the ones that are self-made the ones that don't didn't inherit the funds that's a, a big percentage of them right probably 80 percent or so of them are self-made so they started from scratch and they're affluent right so they learned how to build wealth 
and they did it by by learning by growing their skills by becoming but the main thing is that they are positive thinkers they believe right they believe that they're going to accomplish things and instead the the you know the not rich or the stand the regular folk if you will right believe that it's about the external circumstances right they believe that their their wealth or their the the fact they're poor is because they don't have a good enough job they believe it's because you know the economy is not doing good they be, believe because the president is making decisions for them they believe that it's an outside the weather is bad be, and that's why they they can't work today or whatever right that's but the affluent the ultra affluent the ultra rich and the affluent they think that about that it's all in their control they choose to ac accomplish something then that's how they end up accomplishing it because they believe they can accomplish it so they're positive thinking right so they and you know they don't want to be <coughs> in pessimist groups they don't want to be involved with those <coughs> you know what I guess I would be I'm kind of like that so I don't want to be you know in in places where people are sucking the positivity out of me by by telling me all about all their negative things and whatever I don't even want to be part of that I just get away from it right and that's what these people do too they don't get involved with people that are not positive that's why when you're doing your marketing you don't want to say things like you don't want to miss this that's not and it's and that's just general marketing general copy right if you say you don't want to miss this and you know I hear that all the time in all sorts of ads on the radio every, everywhere people use that all the time you know we've got this great sale you don't want to miss it right but the thing is that that's negative thinking you don't want to miss it is negative thinking right instead of saying you don't want to miss it why don't you say get get over here so you you can you can join in get here to take part be part of the people who have who get this or who who um what's uh make it make it unique right make it unique come here be here to be um uh oh, Jesus I gotta I gotta get those words I I'm trying to think of those words be you know the one that gets it be one of the f select few to get your hands on this you know be one of the select few that's a really good one I like that be one of the select few so attention all top leaders from this know the secrets you're about to learn they won't tell you but we will right so I'm going to tell you the secrets that the top leaders know that they're not telling you <laughs> you can learn them from me come on over I'm going to teach you the secrets right and that's kind of what this this I guess this is kind of what I'm doing there right uh but uh and you know leveraging all those things but yeah so that's uh what else can I do if this is here that's my blog um so that's what marketing to the affluent is like it's based basically you be you know do it so that they see themselves as being part of this elite group they're the only ones that will get this special deal uh, they're the only ones that are going to be part of this group all that is how you do it that's how you do it marketing to the affluent and the ultra rich all right until next time so this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom some of your friends need to hear this message so don't forget to share for more content like this go to courseincomesecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon until next time